Breaking news, Nigerians. Serious war looming. Hmm. Tension. As Simon Ekba orders Biafran fighters to send this set of people to their grave. Details will shock him. Nigerians, South is done scatter. Simon Ekba don't come again as he don't direct and fighters. Say me they remove these people. Come on for here. You understand? Say me then buy them. Okay? So right now, uh South is done scatter and I ain't be the true. Um even courts. They don't they shut down uh, consigning the directives when you don't give people don't they ready for the for the matter. Simon Ekba, a vocal leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, has continued his campaign of resistance against Nigerian governmental figures. This time targeting Governor Charles Chukuma Soludo of Anambra State in a social media post. Simon Ekba accuses Soludo of threatening the people of Biafra, hitting the governor's actions may escalate to violence against Biafrans. Ekba further declares that the Anambra Command of the Biafra Defense Force (BDF) will initiate the op an operation would need them kill the Python aimed at neutralizing Soludo's perceived, uh, perceived threat. This statement not only underscores the continued tensions between the pro Biafra fashions and uh, the, the state's authorities, but also signals a potential for further unrest in the southeastern region of Nigeria. Governor Charles Soludo, an economist and the former governor of the Central Bank of Nigeria, has held office as Anambra State Governor since 2022. His governance, like those before him, has been marked by attempts to maintain peace and development in a state often caught in crossfire of Biafran agitation. However, leaders like Simon Ekba who have a significant following among the separatist followers, I meant to say, among the separatist movement, see Soludo's leadership as an extension of the Nigerian government's efforts to suppress Biafran identity and autonomy. The statement from Ekba reflects the border narrative within IPOP, which considered many Nigerian officials as illegitimate rulers over Biafran people, is reference to Soludo having lost legitimate suggests a deeper disdrain for any attempt to suppress the pro Biafran movement. The allusion to Operation Python Dance a military operation previously carried out by the Nigerian army. The southeastern region further emphasized the ongoing tension between the state force, uh, the state forces and the uh, IPOP members. A past use of the term Operation Kill the Python could be symbolic called to resist any state but oppression of their friends. The involvement of the Biafran Defense Force, BDF, in a class rhetoric highlights the gravity of the situation. Why IPOP claimed that its movement is not violent, references to parliamentary actions like those suggested in his tweets indicate a potential for militarized uh, responses to government pressure. And this has historically led to clashes between the IPOP supporters and Nigerian security force, raising concerns about the safety and stability of the southeastern region. A past confrontation stands against Governor Soludo is reflective of the broader challenges that southeastern leaders face in balancing regional loyalty with their responsibilities to the Nigerian state. Soludo's administration is thus caught in a difficult position navigating the need for governance while trying to quell separatist sentiments. Ekba's public threat 
against Soludo only served to amplify the volatile political climate, featuring the divide between the Nigerian states and southeastern uh, constituents. As tensions remain high, Ekbar's de declarations and continued defiance of the Nigerian government make it clear that the call for Biafran's independence is far from ever. His statements, particularly those inciting resistance and military like operations, present a real challenge for officials like Soludo, who must now find ways to govern and make growing opposition from separatist leaders. So, guys, things are really get, getting, you know, uh, hot in the southeast. Things are really getting getting messy in the southeast, and this is not good at all. I'm dropping it here. Kindly drop your comment below the comment section. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Please share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the.